New probing cycles have been added to CAMWORKS 2023. A new three-point plane probing cycle has been added to select probing points along the z-axis. The probed points can be used to establish a plane. The three points will be positioned at the default offset values under the default settings, and the offset values can be modified to probe the points at the required locations. The probing cycle can then be simulated using the preview option. New probing cycles to measure the angle of a face or surface with respect to the X and Y machine axis have also been added to CAMWORKS 2023. The face selected for probing needs to be parallel to the Z-axis of the setup. The two points will be positioned symmetrically around the centroid of the selected face. The distance between the points and the Z-position can be adjusted, and the vector angle measurements are displayed at the bottom of the probe cycle dialog box. In addition, CAMWORKS 2023 also includes new probing cycles for measuring the slope of a surface with respect to the fourth axis. One cycle for measuring the slope along the x-axis has been added, along with a cycle for measuring the slope along the y-axis. The resultant value can be used to compensate the rotary axis. Similar to the new angle measurement cycles, the selected face must be parallel to the z-axis of the setup. The start point of the toolpath will be set to the centroid of the surface. The probing points will be symmetrical about the start point based on the assigned distance of the two probing points. The distance between the points can be adjusted as well as the z-axis location of the points. The probe movements will be parallel to the axis of the selected cycle. The clearance distance will be measured from the reference point of the surface. In addition, a new output option is available as well. It's under the Tool tab, and you'll find it down at the bottom where the output for the probe can be selected as either tip or center. 